My name is Jennifer and I work as a 911 dispatcher for Escambia County, Florida. As a dispatcher, I'm responsible for taking 911 phone calls throughout the county, dispatching EMS and the fire department. For example, when a call comes in, we'll get the necessary information like location, name, and phone number just so we can call them back if necessary. We'll take down all the necessary information and put it into the computer. The computer will then send that information to the fire console or the EMS console so they can distribute the closest ambulance or fire truck to the emergency. We also get a lot of law enforcement calls, so we'll take the call information, like location, name, and number as well, and then we'll go ahead and transfer that caller to the correct law enforcement agency. The level of stress as a 911 dispatcher, it all depends on the day. Uh, during a natural disaster, the stress is high. Calls come in and they don't stop. Uh, also, we, also, we get emergency calls that um, require us to give CPR instructions or help uh, deliver a baby over the phone, or choking. Uh, it's all stressful. Even though we have a script right in front of us, mentally it's stressful. Uh, shift work is stressful. Well, we are away from our families uh, during the holidays and uh, during 12 hours each day we work. So stress is high. It's nonstop sometimes. Typically, dispatchers work shift work. Uh, for instance, I work five 12-hour shifts one week, and the next week I'll only work two. But 911 is a 24-7 all-day job, even on the holidays. So if my shift falls on a holiday, I'm working that holiday. Requirements for the job um, include a high school diploma, um, other skills necessary are you should be able to type 35 words a minute, have a customer service background, be able to handle high stress situations, uh, be very organized, and ready to take on the next emergency. The best part of my, about my job is that I get to help people. And I know that sounds like a cliche, but it is true. Um, I'm there on the other end of the phone to help somebody, uh, usually on the worst days of their lives. And um, I might make a difference. I might not make a difference, but knowing that I tried to make a difference for that specific emergency is the best part of my day. The worst part of my job is taking emergency calls, horrendous emergency calls for 12 hours and not knowing the outcome of them at the end of the day. Some emergencies consist of children dying in front of their loved ones, friends, other family members dying right in front of the caller. And I'm trying to help the caller stay calm. And this job isn't for everybody. Some people aren't equipped to handle the emergencies heard every day. If it is something that you're interested, you should visit your local public safety office and see if you can sit in and observe some dispatchers for the day. Also, remember 35 words a minute is a national average. Uh, it could be more depending on where you live. Um, customer service background is always a must because we're dealing with customers all day long as well.